Hey YouTubers, um, as you know, I don't like to be in front of the camera much, but I'm pissed. I mentioned on my husband's YouTube page about gurneys. Um, I ordered a lot of seeds, a lot of plants. If you watch his YouTube, um, the Great Northwoods Hillbilly, you will see how my garden was going. I ordered to, through gurneys.com um, a lot of their seeds to even grow. I didn't even receive everything I ordered. They waited about three months after I ordered some stuff to say, oops, we don't have it. Sorry, here's your money back. Now, I received a bill. I couldn't believe it. I paid on my debit card right as soon as I ordered I paid and um, now they're saying I owe them for shipping because they decided to divide my um, order up because some of it couldn't be shipped right away and some of it could well that's not my fault or or anybody else's you can't go and say hey yeah guess what you paid, but we didn't charge you enough money for shipping your seats or whatever. No, if you ate some of that money, tough. That's your stupidity. Um, I've been management, business management. I went to college for it, and it. Um, in college, you learn if you don't charge your customers the proper amount too bad you eat it your mistake don't do it again change your policies or change your shipping whatever you have to do to make sure you get the profit that you need but don't charge your customer again especially if they already paid for that item um I'll never, ever, ever use gurneys again. This was first year. It just did not work. I had over 700 plants that I planted from them. And I don't think I have 300 worth of plants ready to go or anything to be outside. I don't have many. I have lost a lot of money because of it, and I'll never do it again. Um, I've actually had to go and buy more plants because the seeds didn't grow. Like my zucchini seeds, I ordered them, I planted a good 20 of them, none of them came up, not one. I had to go buy some more from a greenhouse so it would be up to where the rest of my garden was and that's money down the tubes so yeah like I said I don't like being in front of the camera um, but I thought people should know be aware if you order from gurneys make sure you get what you order and make sure you keep track how much you paid so they can not charge you again. Because that to me is BS. Um, like I said, I didn't get stuff that I ordered. I ordered stuff back in January. And just last month, I was told, oh, sorry, we didn't have that amount. Um, other people got it before you. Sorry, here's your money back. I really was planning on having that plant or those seeds. Now I can't have them. And yeah, granted they gave me back my money, but at the same time, I needed what I ordered. Um, it wasn't for fun, like a pair of shoes. It's food for my family. It's food for my neighbors, whoever could use it at the time. I'm trying to grow enough to make sure my family is taken care of and some of my friends and stuff. Um, 
I can't have that kind of a mess up. Just because their website wasn't updated, it's not my fault. And what is this? Should have been first come, first serve. No, it was, oh, this order was bigger than yours, so we're going to fill theirs over you. That was right in their email. That's not right. That's not cool. I'm going to go with a different company next year. Um, I'm going to save a lot of my own seeds anyways. So it saves me money. But whatever I can't save seeds of, I will buy it from somewhere else. Not from Gurney's again. So I figured I'd let you know. And hopefully none of you will ever go through this. Because it's not right. I wouldn't do that to somebody. I wish other people would do that to people. You know, it's just big wigs. Get more money in the pocket, pad in the pocket, and not caring who they screw. Alright? Have a good day. Thanks for listening.